Hello everyone, we are here at beautiful Cinco de Mayo Day in Old Town. And now I'm right now I'm standing in front of the Whaley House. Ooh scary place. But see I'm gonna go down here, I'm gonna interview these people. You know, someone some guys and girls or, or what you know what not and you know just see how it goes out. Uh, let's go down there and go check it out. Hey girlfriend, how's it going today? What's your name? Wendy. Wendy, beautiful name. Hey, so uh, so so, what's your plans down here? What restaurant are you going to go to? What's up? Why are you watching come here? What's up? I've been going to Fred's um, Mexican restaurant and like everybody else celebrating Cinco de Mayo. Ooh, plans for Cinco okay, what, what, de Okay, what does Cinco de Mayo mean to you? To me, zero. I have no idea. I heard there is the first movement of independence and Battle of Mexico. Puebla. There you go, Battle of Puebla. Yeah, that's you know? what that's actually I'm I'm Mexican and I didn't even know that, but this like Asian girl told me that. So fine. How do you yeah. like uh the final here? So what type of wine have you um taken so far today? Um basically Rosa Blanca, my Zimbabwean. Hey, how's it going? What, what's your name, ma'am? Crazy. What's your first uh, experience in this wine bar? I mean, where are we? located in the Old Town area of San Diego. Did you come with your boyfriend? Uh, no, I didn't. Oh, I thought you came with your boyfriend. Oh, well, I don't know where he went. Oh. Hello. Hey, guys, how's it going today? Uh, we're at this beautiful Cinco de Mayo celebration. I mean, are, are, are we? Are we or not? Is it beautiful to see you guys? Yeah, so, uh, so, so anyway, why'd you guys come to this uh, beautiful uh, Cinco de Mayo 2011 celebration? What's, what's happening? We're here to celebrate that in Oh, I think that, that was my next question I was going to say. But yeah, thank you for jumping ahead and, and answering it before. I was doing it. I like your style. I like your style. I like your style. So, um, did, did we all come for the, um, for like, for like to celebrate the Battle of Puebla, or did we come for the margaritas today? A combination of both. Or, or I can see, I can see the beers. Thank you all. Okay, man, like, we're staying with the, we're staying with the margaritas. All right, that's cool, that's cool. All right, so, uh, uh what, what's your guys' name? Randy. Beautiful guys. Alright, I'll, uh, I'll let you guys get back to your, your consumption of the drinks, alcoholic beverages, and whatnot. And uh, I, I love this backdrop, it was, it's looking pretty good here. Anyway, guys, alright, thank you. Talk to you later. How are you doing today? I'm fine. Good. How are you doing? Great, I'm doing great. So, uh, so why did you come out to the Cinco de Mayo Festival today here at uh, the lovely San Diego Old Town? Uh, well, we haven't been to San Diego for a while, so we thought we'd come and hang out for a little bit. What time did you get here? Good. Um, it may mean something for you guys. I mean, what does it signify for you? Oh, well, Cinco de Mayo, you know, is um, the day that we celebrate where I see it. I mean, it's not only about drinking and eating, you know, the past time, but it's a lot of people talking about Yeah, yeah, yeah totally. Hey, girl, how you doing today? Hey, girl, how you doing today? Hey, girl, how you doing today? Good, good. So, I see here, I see you going on now. Hello, it's Thanksgiving. What's happening around? Where are we? Oh, it's party. Hey, girl, how you doing today? Hey, girl, how you doing today? Hey, girl, how you doing today? So, I see you here, I see you going on now. Hey,
Well, I know, you know, my last time I played a set, it's independent. No, 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 Really? Yeah, this is something else, but I was not paying attention to it. It's just like an excuse today for people to drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's what everyone else was saying. They drink and party and blah, blah, blah. Right. And then we came following that up with the guest white wine. <laughs> and that was a pretty good hit because it was, it was Niagara by Bernardo Winery. And that's what that was came to it. And the hit right here says, This Native American wine, great variety of widely planted white grapes, and it's vigorously hardening plant. The juices make a very light, sweet, and flavorful wine. So it was pretty good. And, uh, no, you know, I think I'll end. That's two or three wines. That's your third wine. I didn't want to make it, I can't remember. Yeah, well. Uh, and the last one I made was uh, Oro, Oro, Chardonnay, and you know they're all good, so we have two more ones to take, me and my girlfriend, we came out the uh, Hacienda de la Rosa, Winery, Hacienda de la Rosa, Winery, alright, alright, but anyway, yeah, alright, so I'll see you later,